Ladies, hello. You might just be joining me, but I have been filming and my new phone is playing up. I'm en route to Sydney. I'm on a flight on BA. Lila is here. Dido is here. He's coming to work with us. And Nisha. I'm in the club. So I in premium economy. Dido's in premium economy. We're separated in the plane. and okay. the only flight and seats we can get. So I've been feeling very... Um, busy in the last few weeks and I'm a little bit run down so I have to plan very carefully what I'm going to put and use and take on the plane. <laughs> Any of you watch my uh, film from my last BA flight, you'll know, you'll know that I um, have propensity to have a lot of avocados which I haven't got this time and I change, I'm going to show you what I've got instead. Um, thank you Sharon, that's better. Okay, now, back in the room. Thank so, you. Crew, oh okay, so food-wise, my little care package of food consists of, because I think having red rolls in the sky bloats me like... I'm going to be in Sydney for six days my promotion trip in London. I'm going on Project Chat Show. I'm going on Morning Telly on Channel 7, Channel 9, Channel 6 many different channels. I can't wait. And I'm going to do one event for the Trinity Tribe Australia on Thursday night. I've got my black bread. I love this bread. It's never bloats me. And I get it in Waitrose. It's a really great bread. I've got chocolate that somebody very kindly, one of the Trinity Tribe babies, sent me this sort of care package. And this is like the most delicious chocolate. So my trainer is looking look away now. I always need chocolate on a flight, I just do. Then I have oat cakes, which I've always traditionally had on a flight, and I just like oat cakes. They're a bit bloaty, but I don't mind. I have travel prebiotics, which I'm going to take on right now. Um, when I travel, I always take travel prebiotics in Veridon. I get from Victoria Health. But they're very good travel prebiotic, and I think that going to any country more than five hours from England, I just think there's a necessity. Um, let me get my water. I've got in the water some oregano oil I just put in, and I've got a little bit of a chill, and somebody said to me that's very good to take. So I've got that in here, I'm going to take some of that now. Try and drink a lot of water before I go to sleep. I've got some other lovely oily things. I've got very old lavender. I'm nearly at the end of it. I got in my um, town in uh, France. So I put that on the back there to make everything smell nice. Uh, I kind of need always whatever, wherever I'm traveling on a plane, I like to have the area around me smell nice. And I generally, if I'm sitting right next to somebody, I'll ask them, do you mind? And then for landing, I take the roly. I got this from um, Neil's yard, but they sell the aromatherapy absolute. It really is an unbelievably uplifting scent. And I think that when you land, you feel a bit out of sorts, and I feel that scent does it. But by the way, the origami tastes fine. Really tastes fine. I've got also Ilapoca 3, which I got from Victoria Health as well. I've got two things. I've got the SOS Pearl Drops, which is a modern day rescue remedy used in a moment of anxiety and restlessness. And you put them under your tongue, like that. I'm not restless now, but I just want to tell you. They just taste quite sweet. And then I've got Speak Your Truth, which is another aromatherapy. And this is sandalwood rose and a tiny bit of vanilla. It's a sort of very feminine smell, but I, I like good smells when I'm around the okay. same. I've got a mask like that because it just, I can't much put on my head now, but it it's a nicer mask than the masks that you get. And I always get impregnated skin and it stops me getting that. Um, what should I go on to next? Yes, my avocado alternative. This. this is a man thing. Cucumbers. Now you might think cucumbers, but cucumbers are really good when you're flying, according to Nancy. So I'm going to try cucumbers this trip. And red peppers. Yellow peppers. And celery. Let's keep hydration for you. 
to stop me munching on too much sugar. I will take a seat back here for sure, which I've got somewhere here. It's about 30 degrees Celsius, 90 degrees Fahrenheit. I'll show you actually. My pill pop. This is my little bag, like Trinity on the Jubilee bag. Face mask I've got as well. Um, little flannels for later. And I got these pills, which are very good for jet lag. So I took one yesterday. It says take two an hour before you fly. I'm a bit late for that. But this is my care package. Perfect toy health. And you said it really helps with jet lag because I got an upgrade on it. So, doing that. Then I've got Zimavane, which is a sleeping pill. I've, I've got, got digestive enzymes. These I get all in Muji because I get quite bloated on the flight. And then if I get indigestion, I have charcoal tablets which are brilliant on a plane for indigestion. They really help. Um, and then here, I've got Ionacel. It's because I'm 24 hours on a plane, right? Ionacel, which is the, the A good vitamin supplement for skin, hair, and eyes. And I don't think I should stop taking supplements just because I'm on the plane. Um, chromium, which is to stop sugar cravings because I want my blood sugar level to be level. Um, magnesium. To take my video clear, that's such a good idea. I'm in Dublin on the 5th to the 10th of November. Um, colon cleanse, which is what I take overnight if I'm a little bit, you know, thing. And milk thistle, which is a really good one to take. So I'm going to now take a couple of each of these. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Try to get them down, me. get Zimavane from my doctor. Um, mm. Hang on, if I take the right ones. Yeah. yeah. Pills pop. And then, I do want to... Actually, I, I, I just had that oregano. liquid version of these tablets. Mm -hmm. I do take liposomal vitamins, but they are more glycosamine and vitamin D3. They're not the ion cell. Um, not at all, even if I hang over, but I don't need it for that. It's more for your, just to have a clean liver. Um, mm. Mm. That's so bad, Sharon. I can't believe that. Oh, can I tell you? Pick up. Now, this, each one, it's all under 100 ml. When I go through, I want to say two things. One is, if you under products, you don't need to, they're all solid. So you don't have, you know, you don't get stopped. What I always do, my trick, is I would like, I take these two and I put them down and then I, I put a coat over them and then I go through and it sort of works. Um, you can use the oregano on your toes or on a capsule as it's a hot oil. Really? Okay, next bag. This is for my whole trip by the way, it's not just for, um, it's not just for the flight. So I've got first defense. Yeah, which is great when you're feeling getting cold. I also have so excited to try this. Flight spray, the first nasal hydration spray for airline passengers. Now, I didn't know I had a dry nose until it was suggested to me that it might be a good thing to say, how on earth I get off this plastic? God only knows. I might have to do that when I'm off it. Because you do get dry on the plane, and I think it's very, very good to have nasal hydration. Take that bit. 
You have thought I need an expert like this, just it's like saline solution, it's not like... Oh, God. Turmeric, spearmint, distilled water. Turmeric, great for not getting germs. I, I love that. Um, then I've also got... What have I got here I want to show? I've got... This is like my go-to. This is what I always have on the plane, and that's cosmetics. It's very greasy, but this is like the best barrier for you, so you don't lose hydration. And if you ask me about long haul flights, cosmetics, C-O-S-M-E-D-I-X, recovery balm. So just put it on, and I just can keep that there. And I just kind of reapply it ever so often. And then I usually, if I've got it in there, I have, but then moisturizer, which I've been trying, and I decant it and then write the name on it because I just do. Um, I have Vintner's daughter, the um, oil, they did an essence, so I got the essence. And then I've got what I which I need to do now. I hope I have, my oh god, I better have. I did have a yes. I love this hydrating mist. It's like my favorite hydrating mist. I'm going to do it now because um, I'm to do this. If I have no makeup on, but I just when you do this, Jesus Christ, going to ask you to do this. Mm. Yep. The nicest spray ever. automatic and cross -check. Plane is moving. I might have to stop in a minute, but it's still running around doing stuff. So, Emma Hardy, hydrating mist, great. And then on top, I'm going to put my rather greasy product. See how greasy it is, I don't really care. Um, I don't care, I'm sitting on a plane, I do not give a shit. I just want to arrive hydrated. I put that on. You don't want to get your hair too near it. There's so much protection and I'll reapply it probably every about six or seven hours. One of my favorite things. Now, last but not least, I've got Walida. It's a great product. Walida Skin Food. I've used this product probably longer than any other product I've ever, um, I've ever had. And so I'll put it on my hands. Altitude oil from Demamiel, 
was like, you know, I packed my suitcase in and I put, I'm trying to remember what else I got in there. That's it, I think. I think it will come back to me. Um, Lynn, hello, Gabrielle. Hello, darling. Hello, darling. I'm going to watch a couple of movies and sleep on that. Yes, use the eye spray and take your makeup off three of mine. Yes, I am. Um, my makeup's are off, so that's good. Um, Sweet Babe Jesus, by the time you're finished, you'll be along. Well, that's the thing, but I, I just thought I wanted to show you. There's Joanna Lovely having a chat with me now. Because I kind of love flying. What I tend to do is I have a little project, and I'll watch a movie, but I also have two years of photographs to do, and I thought I would take that time to just, you know, I've got 29,000 pictures on my phone, I was just going to categorize them a bit. But another part of me feels maybe I should just do nothing. Hi from Hawaii, hello. Are you in Solarium? No, I'm not. Mary, I've been to Sydney so often, I swear by nose hydration as it stops you catching cold. Do you really? The one I've got? I'm so excited. Um, no makeup, I'm proud, thank you. Some airplanes that have Wi Fi, I would love to help it. At least you won't be bored. You know what? I kind of think it's probably healthy for me I don't have Wi Fi because. I'm, you know, on my phone so much, and it's quite good that I just detach. To have 23 hours where I'm just not answering emails is really good for me. Helpful for me, so um, Will I do more lives when I get to Australia? Every step of the way, you can experience Chantal the whole trip with me. I can't wait. It's exciting. And I've got Nisha, who's coming with us um, to do social media. So we'll be, as we land in Singapore, as we land in Sydney, everything. You're probably in the middle of the night for you, but I will. My baggage allowance, I have a very clever system. I have this removal suitcase, which is called International Cabin Baggage, but it fits 55 litres inside instead of normal cabin baggage, which fits 35 to 45. And if you put a really big bag on top, then they don't notice. Unless you're going, there's few flights I go on now, like EasyJet, where you had to fit your suitcase into the thing. Do you remember? Now I haven't felt I've done that. I took that, I took that remover suitcase on EasyJet. I've taken on BA. I've taken it on uh, Swiss Air. Goes through all the time. I can fit ten days of clothing if I'm in the summer. I can fit ten days of clothing. Um, I love my life on cheap skincare, but really need to see it again. I bought some products, but now I know I get a hard time. And I get to do more of those films on cheap skincare because I think there's many, um, many films to come on different regimes. So I'm slowly getting into it. I've called in a few products I felt were missing from my big cupboard, and then I'll be able to give you lots of different options. Um, Margaret Fox, sorry. Hello, Margaret Fox. I'm flying from Heathrow Terminal 5. The plane is moving. It might be time for me to stop because I know they're going to tell me to get all my stuff that's down here and put it up there. And I, I feel like we can do I I will put all the products on the side. When um, I land in Sydney, I will send this film to the team in London and they will upload them on for you so you can see what everything is otherwise you can screen grab it the nasal spray is from um, Victoria Health I'm not coming to Brisbane this trip because I can't do more than one city I'm only coming for six days it's my 16th birthday next week and I need to get back in time for that she's with me on the plane though so we're just doing Sydney and I get to do press I'm doing the project on Sunday night on Monday I'm doing influences of press. Tuesday I'm doing a TV show, I think Channel 9, or maybe Monday I'm doing Channel 9, Channel 7. Wednesday I'm co-hosting a morning show, which I'm really excited by. And then Thursday, for the Trini Tribe Australia, we have four or five Trini Tribes Australia, we um, told them that we had 100 places during the day for a mini masterclass, so those were taken actually in half an hour. And then we decided to put a little event on on Thursday night um, for Trinity Tribe Australians. And the first 150 people who applied got a ticket. So you know who you are. I can't wait to see you there on Thursday night. I'm so sorry that I won't be able to see everybody. But, you know, as I'm going around, I'll post where I am if you happen to be in Sydney. If you see me, come and say hi. And um, if you know where I'm going to be, pop in. Just say hi. You know, I might be... 
I might pop into the local Zara if I got half a minute, a minute spare at Avon um, Bondi Junction at the Westfield. Anyway, I'm, I'd be excited um, to see as many of you as I can in Sydney. Lila is in another seat because, because I need to sleep more than she does. And she's with Dido, and then Nisha is further back. Um, can I just say, Sarah, the floating charcoal spray, and I would really seriously consider um, buying that cosmetics. Um, anyway, ladies, they are. I am going to sleep. We've got it like a 17 hour flight. I'm going to have some dinner, watch a movie, and then take a pill. And then I land in Singapore, and then I'll take a little again. She's going to come now. Now I've got to go. Anyway, can't wait to hang with you later. I might try and do another film Singapore. All right, ladies. Bye.